Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a quick video just to show you how to do something known as a split screen. Why is it important to split my screen? It's important because a typist cannot be typing, for example, file systems and procedures, open up Microsoft Word, write that first line of sentence or that heading and go back to the document, memorize what the next line of sentence is, go back to Microsoft Word and do that. That cannot work, right? We teach in this course that a typist must always have his or her eyes on the copy. And as such, the screen should be split, right? And the new norm or the way forward for exams will be online. Right, and as such, you need to know how to split your screen to know what to do. So, in this video, I'll show you just that. So, here I have a manuscript in front of me, and I need to type what is here in Microsoft Word. The best way to do that is to split my screen, have each document side by side so that I can see what it is that I'm doing, and type accordingly. How do I do that? I'm going to select anywhere on my taskbar, not on any of the icons, because that will just open the icon, but I'm going to select any blank space. I'm going to right click it, and I'm going to go to something known as show windows side by side. I'm going to select that. Once I select that, all the windows that I have open will be shown side by side. The next thing that I need to do is just make adjustments as to how much of the window I want to view. And that is it. This document seems as if I can go down a bit further as it relates to size. And you don't want it too small either so that you can't see what it is that you're doing. Okay, so that is better. So here I have both my documents side by side. I am able to type. And see what it is that I'm doing. All right. So I do hope this video was of assistance. Um, if it is that you are through typing, for example, and you want to go back to the norm, you will just right click again on your desktop, and you go to Undo Show All Windows Side by Side. When you select that, each of the, of the windows will open accordingly, and you fine tune your work, and you can send it to your instructor. And that's it. All you need to know about splitting screen for typing in EDPM. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Please comment below. Please share with your other classmates or colleagues so that they too can benefit from the content. And please subscribe to the channel so that you do not miss an upload. Thanks for watching as each week I seek to make EDPM simple. See you in my next upload.